So Turbo Roo was surrendered at a vet clinic I used to work at in downtown Indianapolis. A lady came in and basically said, I have this puppy that was born without his front legs. I need somebody to just focus on him and take care of him. So we decided that we were going to foster him, and then um, we ended up adopting him. Uh, we made a little toy cart first out of toy parts, um, and that's when a local news station did a story on him. And literally within about 12 to 24 hours, it went international, kind of viral. A gentleman out of San Diego that's an aerospace engineer, saw Turbo's story, decided that he could make something that was a better design than what I had created. Um, and he made all the parts out of a 3D printer. So that kind of um, you know, got Turbo in a cart, got him mobile, got him moving. And then Justin, here in Denver from the 3D print store, got a hold of me. Um, he had a buddy of his that had a dog that needed a, a 3D printed prosthetic device. So we kind of, the past couple months, have been talking back and forth um, about possibly making a newer design, um, coming up with different pieces that can fit pretty much any dog and anything that they need. So that's kind of the partnership that we've created um, you know, with the Denver 3D print store and, and we own a company called Turbo Roo Designs. Um, you know, to be able to provide 3D printed carts for pretty much any dog um, that is missing their front legs. The good thing about the 3D printing is you don't need to spend another 16 hours redoing a whole new cart. You know, you can do little bitty adjustments on the computer, send, hit print, and then it will print off on the 3D, print, the 3D printer. And then it's just, it's quick, easy, pain-free. It's, it's very versatile like that. The previous cart was more kind of, we still did the diameters of what the dog was, but it was, it, it, if, it, if the dog gained more weight than what it normally would, the cart didn't work. Um, and there was a couple other flaws. So with this new design with the 3D print store, it's, it's interchangeable. If, you know, the dog did gain a little bit more weight, you can get a chest piece that would be a little bit bigger um, and stuff like that versus spending money to get a whole brand new cart.